reading a newspaper. Oh, I don't get it. What is that again? It's conceptual art. Conceptual art. Oh, please. Try hiding your pee-pee inside of a dress for Mardi Gras. That is art, my dear. How anyone you know, can support um, suicide is beyond me. Like they mean you'd be surprised how many people are helping behind the scenes. The art. Even yeah. doctors. Wasn't this, uh, in Santorini? Yes. Expensive. Don't ever call it a paper plate. <coughs> I'm sorry, I had a little too much. <coughs> 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 The secret clubhouse. Where's Spanky and Buckwheat? What's this? Already they're planning a retrospective. Ah, that old junk. It's brilliant. You knock off the modesty bullshit. I remember when you used to practice your signature in case you ever became famous. Well, that's one less worry. Why don't you just sign everything real quick? Death is a great career move for an artist. <laughs> and that, look, are, are you sure you're doing the right thing? Hello, Damien. About what? Well, it's God's decision when we die. I told you to leave no, him. No, no, it's okay. Let him talk. Go ahead. Well, have you... Have you thought of the significance of what you're doing? Why I hadn't. I really appreciate you reminding me. I really needed a moral crisis about now. If I buy you a pamphlet, will you fuck off? No, no, stop. <laughs> Who is this guy? I'm only trying to help. Best to shut up. Look. I appreciate your concern, but you don't have to worry about me. I'm fine. I just can't find my keys. So, you and me, we go find my keys. Come on. Look, I want you to leave him alone. I wonder which is braver, taking a life or not taking it. Get the hell out of here, Damien. Thank you, Dr. Kabuakian. Yeah, sorry. I just hate. I just hate to see him go. <sighs> it's the most comfortable bed in the world. Now you'll see it folds out really nice. And this is give you a little privacy. Paul. So, uh, when's the last time you two were together? Of the day he walked out on you. I didn't walk out on you. And now you're back, huh? You're pretending to be his father. I am his father. You haven't been his father for 20 years. Maybe if you'd been his father, none of this would have happened. What, what Did you, you ever think of that? Maybe he wouldn't have turned gay. Maybe he wouldn't be so sick. Did you ever think of that? I think Nick's lucky. Lucky? He's wrapping up unfinished business with everyone he loves. Will you be here tomorrow? Nick and I need to work things out. Honey, it would take years, years for you to work things out. He's got hours. Why don't you just leave him to people who really care about him? Fuck you. I care about him. How about you? Doting on him? Treating him like he's a mama's boy? Stop with all your arguing. Christ. Haven't you heard? It's in the genes. Designer genes. You want to take this and you want to turn it into a star turn. The lover returns. Well, let me tell you something, honey. It's been done and better. You're pathetic. Monty, that was a bit harsh. Way down deep, I'm very superficial. Anyone? Julia. I won't do it. I won't spend a night in the same house with him. Then he's already called the cops. Here it is, Mom. Good night, Dad. Good night, Mom. Come on, let's go. You've been drinking. <laughs> you always hated that. Smell of alcohol in my breath. Fanny. Oh, be careful, Paul. Oh, Jesus. Yes, we all have to stay. Now you see why. I didn't know how to stop being mad at you, Nick. At me? <laughs> you kicked me out, and you left me to die alone. 
Away from the home I built and away from my dog. I oh, don't be a prick. I didn't dump you. It was a shock for me, too. I needed time to adjust. And you really tried. I did. I stopped making love, but I, I stayed with you. I think you were jealous of me for not being sick. Ha! And you were jealous of anyone who came near me. I wasn't jealous. Oh, you Greek, you can't help me. Hey, I'm dying. Why should I care what you have to say? You pushed me away. Because you were afraid that I would abandon you. I wouldn't have left you. We'll never really know now, will we? So you want me to cancel my flight and come back tomorrow? What? Do what you want. You'll either be here or not. Like always. Sunset, leaving my mother empty handed. I guess this is it. I can't do it. I can't be. It's for the best. We tried to make it work, but we just, we just can't. This is my home. A new place will become your home. Can I come back here to die? 